But yeah, we're gonna have a lovely Christmas Eve dinner and then get some drinks. But tomorrow, Kay's the one who's cooking dinner. I don't think, I don't think you're gonna see any of that because Vlogmas will be over. Hello, it is December 24th. I'm Jackson Bird and this is Vlogmas. I almost said Veda. Wow, we made it to the last video and I still haven't gotten the correct series. <laughs> it is Christmas Eve for me, which means this is the last Vlogmas video. Yes. It feels a little weird to be the last one since this final week has been, you know, not everyday videos like it was meant to be. Got kind of off track there. But yes, it is Christmas Eve. We have made it. Evermore unpacked, definitely still not all the way there yet, but I'm not really in a rush. Just want to enjoy this holiday week. I'm not doing too much for Christmas or Christmas Eve. I was originally going to end Vlogmas with a bang and uh, go up to Sleepy Hollow tonight for a, a Christmas Eve church service in the old Dutch church in Sleepy Hollow. Um, but I just, I got tired. As you could maybe tell from the infrequency of Vlogmas videos for the past week, I get a little bit burnt out this month. Turns out multiple trips and moving and general holiday stuff all together while trying to vlog it all is quite a lot to take on. And even more than that, I think after the big day of moving, I wasn't, I didn't have that much on my plate. There wasn't too many interesting things to vlog. So that slowed down as well of having anything of interest to put in videos. But also, yeah, I just, I, I got tired. I am tired. And so I am skipping that trip as much fun as that might be. I'd rather just stick around home today, tonight. I might go out for drinks with friends tonight or I might just stay in and watch like Home Alone or the Santa Claus or something. Either way, it'll be great. And tomorrow I've got some Christmas dinner plans with some friends. We're gonna pull out some old Polish traditions. And then I have a couple days off off. And then on the 28th, I'm going to Boston for my friend's birthday, spend a couple of days there, and then come back in time for New Year's Eve. And I won't probably be vlogging much of that, even though I kind of wish I could like switch the dates around and like that trip could happen during Vlogmas, because that's a little bit more interesting than my several day period of just sitting around and, and not doing much. Well, that's not giving myself any credit. <laughs> I've been doing a lot of work around the house and on my computer, like work work, but I haven't been, you know, out and traveling and doing exciting things that look good on Vlogmas. But anyways, um, right now I am finishing up some Vlogmas videos, getting those up there for you. Also about to start some laundry, although I don't know where my laundry bag is to take my stuff to the laundromat. Fortunately, I don't live that far from one. But yeah, I didn't write it in my inventory and I can't find it in any of the boxes and there's not that many boxes that are unpacked now. So I don't know what happened to it, but that's about what I've got going on for today. Do a little bit more of a reflective wrap up of Vlogmas later in the day, but let's see if anything interesting happens first. No promises. All right, I'm now folding all of the laundry. It was a lot more than I expected. It was just like, well, every towel, pillowcase, curtain, assorted linen, just about that we own, uh, cause we used it all for like packing things in boxes. So I wanted to give it all a fresh clean, probably gonna get rid of some of it. it was just wanted to use it all for packaging. But I am hurrying up and folding that while I watch Downton Abbey finished season six today. So started again at season one, just can't stop watching it. I have not watched many Christmas movies this season because all I've been doing is watching Downton Abbey. Whoops. But anyways, I'm hurrying up with the laundry because I'm now hosting my friend Kay for dinner. We were talking about grabbing drinks and then we were like, should we get dinner? And I was like, well, I actually have all this like food that I could cook. How about I make us dinner? So I am going to get on with that soon and hopefully it'll be a lovely evening with my friend Kay. All right, I've transformed into my Christmas sweater. I actually realized I haven't worn my Christmas sweater like any of them yet. It's my last chance. So I had to wear a Christmas sweater. Um, Brussels sprouts are looking good. We've got some cranberry sauce in the fridge. Sweet potatoes are still cooking. I made a, a table setting. This is Kay, hi Kay. Can I say something to your followers? Sure. <laughs> I was a fictional reindeer. <laughs> <laughs> I was Prancer, a fictional reindeer, that's all. I almost said that in response to the comments, but I did not want to be one of the villains of Vlogmas as all my friends are. It's okay, it's I fine. Will. Yeah, you, it's fine. you be a villain. But yeah, we're gonna have a lovely Christmas Eve dinner and then get some drinks. But tomorrow, Kay's the one who's cooking dinner. I don't think, I don't think you're gonna see any of that because Vlogmas will be over 
I mean, probably not quite, because it's gonna take me a while to get videos up, but filming Vlogmas will be over. So the only way that you can see Kay's amazing Polish dinner that we're gonna make is if you follow me on Instagram, at Jack is not a bird. <laughs> None of that was filmed. I wasn't filming any of that. That was all so genuine and cute. <laughs> Ugh, ruined it. All right, well, all we said was that dinner was absolutely terrible. Um, Kay hates my cooking. Mm -hmm. <laughs> the Brussels sprouts were frozen. It's still frozen. Um, I just took them out of the, the freezer and put them on the table. No, we're gonna, we're gonna go grab some Christmas drinks now. Yes. Some old wine, some German beer, and yeah, it's gonna be Christmas soon. We've got, Santa has less than six hours left to deliver presents. Is it ChristmasYet.com? <laughs> Well, that is it. Vlogmas is done. Got a little off track at the end there, ended the whole thing late, not super happy about that. But you know, I do have to give myself a little bit of credit. I tried to cram all of this in while moving, I started off sick, I had two trips, I had to do all of my other day-to-day -day work and holiday affairs, and I mostly got through it all. And you know what? I'm really glad I did. I'm glad that I have this little, like, time capsule of this wild month. I'm really glad that I can, you know, have these videos of the trip to Hogwarts that I took with my mom and brother and be able to look back on the last couple of days in our beloved old apartment. Getting used to this place, but that other one will always hold a very special place in our hearts. It was just so perfect. And I'm also so glad that I did Vlogmas because I got to share a little bit more with all of you. I'm a very intentionally private person on my channel, usually, and on all of my other social media for a lot of reasons. Sometimes it makes me feel uncomfortable to put so much of myself out there, and I also don't usually want to drag my friends and family into some sort of attention that they didn't sign up for. And it can be like tough to keep up with. Like once you sort of open your life out to the public, sometimes people feel like they need to constantly be updated, and that's just it's weird to me. I like following it in other people, so I guess I'm a little bit of a hypocrite, but yeah, it's it's tough for me to keep up with, and it just all around is often easier for me to just keep things behind closed doors. But I really enjoyed what I did share this month, and I would love to keep doing it in some way. I especially enjoyed getting to show you who I am beyond being trans and get to talk about something other than just trans issues for once on this channel. I mean, I still remain committed to sharing resources and, and stories about trans people and our lives. I think that's very important and valuable work and I love doing it. But I think I want to infuse a little bit more of my non-trans life into videos, even though they won't ever perform as well as trans resource type of videos. Like, I think it's important to show me having a vibrant and fulfilled than normal, I guess, life. Because seeing that in other trans people years ago is what gave me the confidence to like move forward with transition and come out and be public about things. Well, the public thing was sort of a whole other barrel of fish, but <laughs> point is, I like getting to show that side of my life. And I love hearing from you when that is helpful to you to see that as well and, and gives you encouragement. So I'll think about some structured way to share the more everyday parts of my life here and there. Maybe it'll be actually posting those travel vlogs that I mentioned, or maybe like once a month I'll do a more day in the life, like Vlogmas style kind of video, or just every now and then do more videos that are not about trans topics like I used to. I'm not sure yet, maybe a combination of all of those things. I don't know, I'm open to ideas, so if you have thoughts, please do leave those in the comments. And in any case, I had a really great time this month, despite any shortcomings on my part, and I am so grateful to all of you who came along for the ride. And remember, you can still keep up with my day-to-day -day life on the regular on Instagram stories at Jack is not a bird. I know it's been kind of dead over there this month because of Vlogmas, but should get back to regular posting in a few days after I've recovered. <laughs> and you can also follow me on Twitter at Jack is not a bird. And don't forget, I also have merch and a Patreon and a podcast, like allegedly, theoretically, I'll try to get back in the zone with that in 2019. Links to all of that is below. And yeah, just thanks to each of you for joining in on the fun and the cheer this Vlogmas. It has been an absolutely wonderful time and I can't wait to do it again. So happy holidays, happy new year. Thank you so much for watching. Bye.